a vintage Kanye pick for some shit that sounds like vintage Kanye, man, I am all the way down for this shit right here. What's up everybody? It's Luke James, not the singer. If you're an indie artist looking for an album review and some promo, you can hit up Luke at redmattersite.com. And what I have for you boys and girls tonight is just a quick rant review for the tracks that Kanye West put out. Now it's one full track called Real Friends, and on the end of that is a snippet for No More Parties in LA. So I'll talk about that snippet first, and then we'll look at Real Friends. No More Parties in LA is a song produced by Kanye West and Mad Lib, so it has some really dope sample-based production and a little bit of a black exploitation vibe on it, if you ask me. But there's not too much I can say about the rapping here, because like I said, it is a snippet, and all we get is a couple of lines from Kanye, and then Kendrick jumps in, so I'm just going to wait till this full song comes out before I really go into detail and break it down. But it does sound like some fire so far. Now, as for Real Friends, this is a dope track too, because we get this nice delicate and ethereal production from Kanye West, Frank Dukes, Boy Wanda, and Havoc of Mob Deep, so Kanye really got his shit together when it came to the production on this one. It also features Ty Dolla Sign, who comes through on the bridge, the hook, and in some of Kanye's verses. And this is that vintage Kanye West. It actually kind of reminds me of College Dropout Kanye, because there's no abrasiveness, over-the-top auto-tuning. It's just him spitting about some real shit, and in a real way. He's spitting about trust issues, and also some of the problems he has with family and friends. But he also takes a good look at himself and admits that sometimes he forgets birthdays, he forgets to call people, and shit like that. Because as anybody knows, the older you get, and the busier you get, and the more successful you get, it gets a lot harder to maintain relationships. So I feel what Kanye West is saying here, and just imagine how hard it must be for him, because man, he is one of the most popular, most successful people out there in the world, if you ask me. Now, I give this track a 4 out of 5. Like I said, it's a rant review, so I'm not going to break everything down. But this is what I want to hear from Kanye, and it is way better than that fact garbage that he put out not too long ago. I also look forward to hearing the full version of No More Parties in LA, and if we get that, I'm going to review that as a separate track. So stay tuned for that. Thank you for supporting the channel. Let me know what you think in the comments section, and make sure you do all that good YouTube and social media stuff, man, where you like my videos, you share them, you follow me on Twitter, you retweet the videos, and you especially subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching, everybody. I'll see you next time.